What's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Jay, and I'm back at it with another banger. Now, in today's video, I will be showing you guys how to do the best VC glitch in NBA 2K20. Now, before we even get into the glitch, you guys is going to need one of two things, all right? You is going to need either PlayStation Plus or a USB. So if you do not have PlayStation Plus or a USB, you cannot do this glitch. But if you have PlayStation Plus or a USB, you will be able to do this glitch. All right, so since we got a, since we got that out the way, let me tell you guys what the glitch, what the VC glitch is. All right, now before I even do that, bro, look, this player right here, I made this player yesterday, and he an 85 overall in one day, bro. So what I'm trying to say is. I got 200k in one day from doing this glitch, bro. And I did this glitch on two different players, bro. Like, you can get a lot of VC just spamming this glitch, man. You can really just grind this glitch and get a lot of VC. And, bro, you will have, like, 200k in no time. But, look, let me tell you guys what the glitch is. So, you guys know it's a My Player Nation glitch. So, basically, you can play My Player Nation games unlimited amount of times, right? But, wait, before you guys click out this video, wait. The catch is, I know how you can foul out of the My Player Nation games and still get all of your VC, bro. Like, you do not have to play the My Player Nation games. I know how you can foul out. And don't just go to the My Player Nation game, just get six files and foul out. No, because they going to give you zero VC if you do that. It's a way you have to do it, and I will show you guys how to do it in this video. So that's why I say this is a glitch, bro. Like, honestly, once 2K find out about this, it's going to be patched soon. So I'm going to just go and get this video out there before they even patch it. So like I said, bro, it's a My Player Nation glitch. But I watched all these other YouTubers, but the way I'm showing you guys how to do it, you would not have, I repeat, you would not have to play the My Player Nation games, bro. I'm showing you guys a way where you can file out and still get all of your VC. So look, let's just go and get into it. Cause I know a lot of you guys are probably confused and probably saying, but bro, when you get 6-5, they're going to give you zero VC. Just look, pay attention to this video. Just watch and learn, my brother. All right. So first thing first, before you do anything, go to My Player Nation. All right. Now you want to pull out your Android, your iPhone, a piece of paper, your school notebooks, whatever. You want to pull out something where you can write down team names. So, the names you is going to want to write down is the ones with the percentage by their name, all right? So, for example, you guys see where at the very top, the very first team, it say the Warriors versus the Clippers, and it got a W. When you see a W, that means you cannot play that My Player Nation game no more. So, don't worry about that team. Only write down the teams that got the percent. So, as you see, Jazz and Wizards, pick one of them teams. Then go down here, Heat, Knicks, pick one of them, pick one of them teams. Warriors, Grizzlies, pick like, just keep picking one of each teams, bro. One of each teams that got a matchup, cause you is going to be using all of these teams to get, I mean, to get the My Player Nation game. Now, after you wrote down all the teams that got games and uh, all the teams that you want to play with, you want to go. Well, wait, before you do that, you want to go to stats, my minutes. Now, as you guys, as I said, I just made it player, so I don't play heavy minutes. You want to make sure you is a starter and make sure you is playing heavy minutes. So when you go into free agency, you can get the most amount of VC as you possibly can in the My Player Nation game. Like I said, you ain't going to be playing the My Player Nation games. I'm showing you guys a way where you can file out, bro. All right. So you really just make sure you uh playing a lot in my career you feel me i recommend doing this glitch on multiple players just because when you get done with the 13 teams that's it for the day you gotta wait till more nba games come so that's why i say make sure you have multiple players to do this glitch with or you can just have two like me but once you did all that bro you want to go to play next game and just sim the whole season all right just sim the whole sim sim to the end of the season so as you guys see, my team record is 19 and 8. So I might end up having to play the playoffs. So if you guys teams make it to where you gotta play the playoffs in the finals, all you wanna do is after every tip off, sim out the game. That's it. Just sim out, sim out, sim out, sim out. So after you guys do that, it will bring you to the part where you can pick which team you wanna play for. And I will explain everything when we get there. But look, man, I'm going to go let all this stuff right here play out. I'll be right back. All 
all right so as you guys see we is done with the uh regular season now my team made the playoffs so i will be right back when i sim out of all these games bro all right you guys so i'm gonna sim out of my last playoff game so we're gonna wait to tip off all right boom now i'm just gonna sim out of this last game i should end up losing it yeah i knew i was gonna lose it because they bro they done beat us three times straight so i just knew they were gonna sweep us but I don't even know how to, bro, I don't even know how we made the playoffs. I went to New York not to make the playoffs, and we made the playoffs and got swept, bro. Got swept the first round, man. But it's all good, bro. So, as you guys see, we finna be into free agency. Now, you remember the teams I told you to write down? Like, all the teams, the list of names and stuff? So, as you guys see, after you do that, you're gonna go to complete season. And you're gonna let the rest of this ride out. Like, just hit S through all this. Now... The reason I had you guys write down that team is because once you get right here, I'm going to get ready to show you guys in a little while. Don't do it yet. I'm going to tell you guys when to do it. But you got to upload the player. So I'm going to show you guys. Bro, look. Everything going to make sense once you do it, bro. All right? So as you see, the Rockets, they won the finals, bro. But like I was saying, this is where you is going to have to look at where you wrote the teams at. Like the team names that play. And one more thing that I forgot to say, bro. Like the teams I showed you guys, by the time you see this video, they probably gonna have a W beside their name because this video is gonna be uploaded tomorrow. Like it's two o'clock in the morning, I'm making this video. So them teams might have a W by their name, but as long as the teams got a percent by their name, bro, you is good, man. I right, you is good, bro. And my once again, bro, my bad if y'all heard my PlayStation. I know that noise just be annoying people, bro. But look, once you get right here, you want to hit enter free agency. Hit continue. Now, once you get right here, it finna load up, bro. All right. Once you get right here, as you guys see, I'm not getting that much VC because, like I said, I'm doing this on a player I basically just made. That's why I said make sure you play in a lot of minutes in your my career and make sure you as a starter so you can get more at like 1,000 VC. But look, once you get right here, you want to close your app close your app you want to go to your settings all right once you go to settings you want to go to application save data management now you want to click the first one right here okay click the first one. now if you're doing it through playstation plus click uh where it say upload upload to online storage if you use a usb like i'm at like i am click copy and copy to usb so we're gonna copy the usb now we're gonna hit 2k20 so as you guys see, the first after you close out whatever file you was on last, it's gonna be the first one. So as you guys see, my career 0002 is the file I was just on. So I'm gonna click on that one and go to copy. Then they're gonna ask you to overwrite, blah blah blah. Hit yes. All right. Now you're gonna let all these, I mean you're gonna let these let seven, five, four seconds run up. So after the seconds run up, you wanna uh hit the PlayStation button again. You want to go to 2K20. Now, while all this is loading up, be trying to figure out which team you want to go to. Because you guys, you wrote down a lot of teams. Like, you is going to be in all those games, but you don't have to play them. That's why I said I know a trick where you can get uh your six fives and get all your VC. So, that's why I told you guys, you feel me? You got to watch the video. I'm going to get ready to show you guys how to do that right now. As soon as we pick the team. So, let me see. Hold on. Let me go to my notes. Because I picked the team as well with you guys so i can i picked two teams so i can show you guys how to do it twice all right after you get done with your first team i'm showing you guys how to do it like so on and so on and so on like for every team what you got to do so we're gonna let this right here load up let's see i think i think the team i'm gonna pick i think i'm gonna go with the jazz i remember me saying the jazz so look once you go to the my career you want to uh click on the very first i mean you want to just click on whatever my career file you would last on so as you see, this will say season two, game zero. I know this is the one I was on because it's the 85 overall. Like I said, that's why I said make sure you are starting in my career and make sure you playing heavy minutes so you can get the most amount of VC as you can. All right, you probably you gonna get at least 2,300 VC each game, like 2,300 VC each game if you get a thousand VC regular. You feel me? So look for this right here for the free agency. I'm going to pick the Jazz because I remember saying something about the Jazz. So, I remember that team. So, as you guys see, blah, 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 blah. Now, if you 
playing, like if you got heavy minutes and stuff, you should see a thousand VC per game. But since I, and you can counter offer it, try to make it fit where you like it, you feel me? We just gonna leave it like this right here because I'm not doing it for the VC right now. I'm showing you guys how to do the glitch. Now you wanna go to My Player Nation. Now as you guys see, I got 16 hours left on this game. So I'm finna click up. Uh, so I'm finna click into this game right here. Now I'm finna show you guys, this what y'all been waiting on to be honest. Now I'm finna show you guys how you can file out and get all your VC still. And after I show you guys this, I'ma show you guys what you wanna do if you wanna like just keep playing the My Player Nation games over and over. Now keep in mind, so as you see, we was playing the Wizards and I picked the Jazz. When you pick up, when you go to your PlayStation settings, you gonna bring the file back after the game. Now, once you bring the My Career file back after the game, it going to bring you on the screen where you got to pick a new, a light. you going to be in the free agency screen. So, you do not want to pick the team that you just played against. So, as you guys see, I picked the Jazz and I'm playing against the Wizards. When I get ready to pick my next team, do not pick the Wizards because it ain't going to let you play the game because basically you playing it right here. So, it ain't going to let you just, you feel me, you playing with the Jazz one game, then you switch over and go to the Wizards. No. You got to uh, play with one of those teams, then go to the very next team that I told you guys about the percent. You feel me? Now, all you want to do is you want to come in here. They're going to give you the ball. So, let me just go and give them a lit, give them a lit bucket or whatever. All right? Even if I miss. So, basically, you want to get five fouls, bro. Just come in the game, get five fouls. All right? Oh, I thought they were going to him. All right, so you just want to get five fouls. So, that's one foul. Like I said, bro, five fouls. That's it. Do not get six yet. I'm going to show you guys what to do. Do not get six fouls yet. Get five. So I just got my first foul. They going over here to him. I'm going to get my second foul. Now I got to get three more fouls. So as you see, they sending me out. That's why I said make sure you playing heavy minutes so they can keep you in the game and stuff like that. But it's whatever. As you guys see, we got a uh, second left in the first quarter. So this second quarter, I'm going to have to go ahead and get my three other fouls. All right? Now, after I get these three fouls, I will show you guys what to do, all right? So, look, as you guys see, they taking the ball out right here. I can probably get my fourth foul right here, and I can, yo. I mean, my third foul. I said fourth. I'm asleep. But my third foul. Now, I got to get two more fouls. I will let you guys, I will show you guys how to know when to get your sixth foul, all right? Like I said, bro, you don't even have to play the game. You feel me? You basically just coming in here getting five fouls and wait. I'm not going to, I'm not going to talk ahead, bro. Y'all finna, bro, you feel me? Y'all finna watch it. I'm finna just show you guys so I know y'all understand, all right? So as you see, I got three fouls. I'm gonna come down here, hit them with another foul. That's four of them. Then I'm gonna come right back down and hit them with another one and get five fouls, all right? So I'm gonna wait till you get the ball. Bam. Five fouls. All right. So once you get five fouls, bro, you want to stay in the game. As you guys see, I pause it. You guys see where it say minutes and it say one? When you play six minutes, get your sixth foul, all right? And make sure you keep your teammate grade up because the more you keep it up, the more VC you is going to get. So like I said, just keep pausing the game and uh, looking at your minutes. And as soon as your minutes hit six minutes, then you get your last foul. But like I said, dude, look, if you doing this for VC, which you is, do not like let your teammate grade go down. Like keep your teammate grade up. Get your buckets, you feel me? Just play six minutes and just do good, all right? But look, man, I'll be right back after I done played six minutes. So I'm just going to throw up another shot. Big greens, you already know, man. So 18 seconds. All right, it's six minutes. As you guys saw, look, it say six minutes. Now you want to pick up that last foul and get out that game, man. Now all they is going to do is send you to the bench and you will just have to hold X to the end of the game and you will get your VC. So I'm going to just go on fast forward and make everything go faster so I can show you guys that I got my VC. Now you guys is finna see Right here, it gonna give me the VC, so it giving me my my points, it giving me my badge points or whatever. And for VC, as you guys finna see, I fouled out, and it's gonna give me all of my VC. So as you see, salary 800, blah, 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 blah. I got 800 VC from that game in six minutes. Now, like I said, if you guys doing this with a player that you play career with, you will get like a 1,000, 2,300 VC each game in six minutes, bro, for doing nothing. So look, once you guys are done with that game, all you want to do, close out. Go to settings, all right? 
application save data go to save if you do it if you did it through playstation plus go to save data online and online storage but if you did it through usb like me go to save data on usb all right you want to go to copy the system storage you want to hit that 2k20 now you want to hit the very first because that's the player that you jet that you last copy all right you want to click that one hit copy hit yes now after you do that you want to go back to 2k and when you go back to the player it will have you where you have to select your team again but look man i'm finna go on fast forward this so we can get back onto the player but go to career click on the first file as you see it, it say i play with the jazz but i guess it glitch out like that when i hit s on it i'm gonna be back into free agency as you guys see and now this is where you pick the next team you want to play with so uh i remember seeing the lakers up there so we're gonna go with the lakers because i remember seeing the lakers on the uh my player nation stuff so after you choose your team go to my player nation boom it's the laker game now you can play that do that over and over and just spam that up on each of your players and hey man you gonna have a lot of vc but i hope you guys enjoyed this banger don't forget to leave a like and subscribe for more great content it's your boy jay and i'm out peace